let's take a look at this example so we have this part aligned as you can turn the coordinate system and as you see it lies at the bottom it's nicely oriented and this uh, plane is the bottom one and the other one is the side one I can put it on top view and everything looks okay so what I want to do now is to create a revolved surface so I select this side and I will go and try some to fit and then I will just try press OK here and then I go to 2D sketching and my initial reaction would be OK I want to create a revolved surface click revolve surface and by default it takes the z-axis so I move and look and everything looks OK and then when I press stack section I see oh my gosh something goes wrong here and the software is not working properly and there is a bug and we report this to the support team but let's take a look a bit more carefully I'll put it on top view and if you see you think that actually this is around this axis but it's not true because if I put the cylinder on my center of the cylinder is somewhere here so in fact this revolved surface should not use the z-axis for the axis of revolution but it needs to take the cylinder axis to do this in this case the solution simply is instead of using z-axis as a reference I just use the cylinder as a reference and now if I take a look at my stacked sections they are properly extracted and all of them are where they want them to be I even can put 200 and you see all of them are on the correct place I press OK take a look and all of them are put together in the correct position so in conclusions be careful when you define the axis for revolved surface as it makes sense which line should be used for this uh, 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 sectioning I hope this uh, tip is useful for your use in any complex project. Thank you for watching.